Welcome to this brief guide on how to create a graphical email signature using Canva. Tired of your emails ending with a jumbled mess of contact details? Frustrated that your signature doesn't reflect your professionalism? Or maybe your business is just starting out and you have no idea where to even begin. We'll say goodbye to the signature stress because today we're diving into Canva, the design platform that makes creating a stunning professional email signature a breeze. In this step-by-step -step tutorial, we'll walk through everything from choosing the perfect template to customizing it with your own flair. I'll even show you how to add your signature to both Gmail and the new Outlook complete with a clickable link to your website or social media profile. By the end, you'll have a signature that not only leaves a lasting impression, but also drives engagement. So let's get started. Open your web browser and head over to canva.com and sign in. You can even use sign in with Google to make this easier. Once you're there, you'll see a search bar at the top of the page. Type in email signature and hit enter. Canva will present you with a plethora of professionally designed email signature templates. Take a moment to scroll through and appreciate the diversity of styles available. Whether you're looking for something minimalist and modern or bold and colorful, there's bound to be a template that catches your eye. Notice how some templates focus on showcasing your profile picture while others emphasize your contact information. Consider which elements are most important to you and choose a template that aligns with your priorities. Once you've found a template that speaks to you, click on it to open the Canva editor. Here, you'll see the template laid out with placeholder text and images. Let's start by replacing a couple of these placeholders with your own information. Simply click on any text box and start typing to replace the placeholder text with your name, title, company, phone number, email address, or any other relevant contact information. Feel free to rearrange the text boxes or resize them as needed to achieve your desired layout. Next, let's add a personal touch by uploading your profile picture or company logo. Click on the Uploads tab on the left side of the editor and then select Upload Media. Choose the image file from your computer and wait for it to upload. Once uploaded, simply drag and drop the image onto the template. You can resize the image by clicking and dragging its corners and you can reposition it by clicking and dragging it to the desired location. Canva also provides tools for cropping and adjusting the image's brightness and contrast if needed. Now comes the fun part, adding your own unique style to the signature. Canva offers a wealth of customization options to help you create a signature that truly stands out. Start by experimenting with different background colors. You can choose from a pre-selected palette or use the color picker to find the perfect shade. Next, explore the vast library of fonts available and select one that complements your overall design. Remember though, readability is key to making your signature accessible to all, so avoid overly decorative or difficult to read fonts. If you want some extra visual interest, consider incorporating icons or graphic elements. Canva has a vast library of icons and illustrations that you can search and add to your design. Just be mindful not to overcrowd the signature. A few well-placed elements can go a long way. Once you're completely satisfied with your masterpiece, it's time to download it. Locate the share button in the top right corner of the editor and click on it. Then select download. A drop-down menu will appear offering various file format options. For email signatures, it's best to choose PNG as it provides a high quality image and supports transparent layers, ensuring it will look seamless when embedded in your emails. Finally, click the download button again to save the PNG to your computer. Remember where you saved it 
as you'll need to access it in the next steps. Now that you have your signature ready, let's add it to your Gmail account. First, open your Gmail inbox and click on the gear icon in the top right corner to access the settings menu. From the drop down menu, select See All Settings to open the full settings page. Scroll down until you find the signature section. Select Create New to make your first signature. Be sure to name it something that is memorable to you. You can even have multiple signatures for different purposes. Once named, you'll see a text editor where you can create or edit your signature. To add your Canva signature, click on the Insert Image icon, which looks like a small mountain. A new window will pop up, allowing you to upload the signature image from your computer. Navigate to the location where you saved the PNG file, select it and click on Open. The image will now be inserted into your signature. You can adjust the size of the image by clicking and dragging its corners or selecting one of the preset options. You can also add additional text above or below the image if needed. Now, let's make your signature interactive. Highlight the entire signature image by clicking on it and then click on the link icon in the toolbar, which looks like a chain link. A dialog box will appear. Here you want to paste the URL that you want to link to. Examples such as your website or LinkedIn profile. Into the web address field and click on OK. Once you're happy with your signature, select your signature to be used as the default for new emails. You can also use a different signature for replies and forwards if you prefer. Then scroll down to the bottom of the settings page and click the Save Changes button. Your new clickable signature will now be automatically added to your outgoing emails. For Outlook users, the process is slightly different but is equally straightforward. Open your Outlook account on the web and click on the settings cog in the top right corner. From the pop-up window, select Mail and then open the Compose and Reply option. You will see the email signature section located right there at the top. Here you can create, edit and manage your email signatures. To add your new Canva signature, click on the New Signature button to create a new signature. Give your signature a name, just like we did in Gmail, and then click in the editor box below. To insert your Canva signature, select the Insert Picture option and choose your image. Yet again, just like we did for Gmail. And just like in Gmail, you can adjust the image size and add additional text as needed. Now to make your signature clickable, right click on the image and select Link from the context menu. A dialog box will also appear. Paste in the URL that you want to link to in the address field and click on OK. The final step is to select our default signature for new messages and our one for replies or forwards and then click on save to finalize these choices. Your Canva signature, complete with the clickable link, is now ready to be used in your Outlook emails. And there you have it. In just a few simple steps, you've transformed your email signature from drab to fab. Remember, a well-crafted signature is more than just a collection of contact details. It's like your digital handshake, a visual representation of your brand and a powerful tool for making a lasting impression. Now that you've mastered the art of the email signature, you're one step closer to conquering the digital world. So go forth and impress with every email you send and I'll catch you in my next video. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more content like this, be sure to check out the channel. And if you like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button.